Good morning. Good morning. We're all going on a summer holiday. Wow, we saw some holiday in the sky today. It's grey. It's grey and cloudy. Great. We're starting our holiday off right. Well, we said holiday, we're literally going for one night. We're starting our little holiday off right. Where else would we go? Oh, the McDonald's. Oh, we've got his usual. Remember when you hate, well, you hate, yeah, you hate McDonald's breakfast. Yeah. I used to not like McDonald's breakfast. Like when we went to Florida. So freaky, man. It would be like, we'd go out for breakfast to McDonald's and it, I'd have to sit there and wait until half ten until I started doing normal food. Yeah, we'd leave like probably ten o'clock to get the Mackies and then everyone gets their food. <laughs> I'm sure. And then we have to wait until half ten for Shan to. Uh, you know what's mad though? I think about it now and I think I used to eat a full on meal, like a chicken burger, co. Chips at half ten in the morning, <laughs> and then I got a sausage and egg McMuffin, no egg. And then, guys, you'll be really proud. So, if you watch my trying new foods video, I tried this. It's the cheesy bacon flatbread, but of course, I'm gonna take the bacon off it. Do you want the bacon on there? Genius. I have it on my wall. Okay. So I'm gonna pick the bacon off this because the bacon's just not. The bread's different to when I tried it the other McDonald's. Look. It's got lines in. That was so crap. They've stinged out. <laughs> Last time I had one, it was awful, full like. of cheese, and now it's literally got one square of cheese on there. Where even are we? What part of the world is this? We're in Didcot. Didcot scam you if you ever go to Didcot, don't go to McDonald's. I'm actually still upset about this. We are. We're in Oxford. Oxford. Oxford don't know how to do a cheesy bacon flatbread because what is that? <laughs> what is that? As if I've actually just paid for that. What do you mean? Saying that's a good deal? Yay. Mm. How's your cheese on toast this morning? Very dry. I have one of them. Take one at the back because we can't hold them. Cheese. Can you at the bottom? Me to the bottom. We've still got another hour and a half. Yeah. Until we get there. This is how much bacon you get on your cheesy bacon flatbread. I love that we have all that. That looks so nice. You so excited for that on your burger? Yeah, man. Uh, wow. That makes it look wow. freaking unreal. Michelin star this dessert. That looks just like the advert. Show them. Show them your sausage name with nothing. Mmm. <laughs> Yummy. So as you can see by the title, today we're going on... It's not really a holiday. It's just like a night away that we're going. So Oak booked Bournemouth as a surprise for me for hitting 10k. So we're going there today. We are hoping it's going to be really sunny because it... It's literally been blue skies for I don't know how long now. I trust it to be the day that we go. It's literally crazy. Mm. It's all going to be sick though. Mm. He's booked a sick hotel right on the beach. On the beach, mate. It's got a pool. What else have you got? A spa? Yeah. A spa. Literally, just walk out of the hotel and you're on the beach. Oh, well. Can't wait. Can't. I just love the English seaside. I've been like every single year since I was a kid. I went to Great Armour. You don't really go to the English seaside, do you? No, nah, we used to a lot when I was younger, younger. Mm. But after then, like, once we was old enough, we started just going abroad instead. Yeah, but my family still go to Great Yarmouth every single year. And as a kid, I went every year and I loved it. So I just love like, the English seaside. And it's going to be good to go to somewhere that I've never been to before. Yeah, I've never been born with fever. You know, because you go to Great Yarmouth every year, you know what's there, you know what to expect. Mm. So I'm excited. I'm excited. And there's also mini golf. Mm, we love a bit of mini golf. Did you put my sugars in, yeah? Mm -hmm. Oh, Angel. You're welcome. Thanks, darling. You're welcome. Oh, Lord Jesus, there's a fire. On the way down here, we've been blasting like old school songs, haven't we? Oh, end dubs. End dubs. The best days. What else have we been listening to? You worked on a bit of Akon. Akon, Ed Sheeran. Ed Sheeran's not really that old song. school. I know, yeah, but we had Labyrinth. a bit of. Um, I really don't like Labyrinth. I really nah, don't like it. You don't like it. Had Labyrinth. a bit of reggae on. Tiny Temper. Mm hmm. Getting Rihanna. in the mood for the Euros. What was that song? Waka Waka, and then we also listen to Waving Flag. When I get older, I, I will be stronger. stronger. They'll come get freedom. Mm -mm, mm -mm, like the mm -mm, waving flag. Mm -mm. Banga. Gets you in the mood for football, that doesn't it? Can't wait now. It's mad because I've been saying to my mates, like, I actually don't think England are going to get out of the group stages. That means nothing to me. And probably nothing to anyone watching either. Really? <laughs> nah, yeah. people know about people know. <laughs> Why would you do that, you dick? I don't know where the bottom half went. <laughs> From down the side. See you in Bournemouth. See ya. Woo!
So we're here. We've been here for a while now, but we've been walking around the shops and stuff. And I didn't think I was going to vlog that because I do that in England, so it's not really exciting. I did get two things from Zara though, and I'll show you those in a bit because they're in Oak's mum's room. Oh, I haven't even showed you my new trainers. Mm. Do you want to try trainers, guys? You haven't, yeah? No. So it's been cloudy all day, which is why we decided to go to the shops because the original plan was to get here, sit by the pool, chill for a few hours because we've got a pool. Um, but it was cloudy and cold, so I thought I'm not going in the pool. So we walked around the shops, just had a KFC. Um, any more updates, Oakster? Uh, it's hot. <laughs> the weather's got better. Yeah, the sky's Literally, we've got here, and, like you heard us say earlier, the sky is grey. Now. Shan, look, it's literally like blue. Oh, should we show you our view? We haven't got a sea view room because they were all sold out. But technically, we've now got a sea view room. You ignore all the scaffolding that's down the side. Beautiful. It's a sea view. Personally, I think the scaffolding makes it. Makes it. You look over there. <laughs> we've got a sea view. And it's apparently the nicest beach in the UK as well. Let's just pretend all that scaffolding isn't there. I'm going to do a reveal of my new shoes, guys. You're not ready for this. They're actually unreal. So you would have saw if you watched the 10,000 subscriber celebration vlog that Oak ordered me these trainers. And they came yesterday. And how sick are they? They're actually unreal. Shut we had up. a bit of a mare though, didn't we, Oak? And uh, the sides yeah. are in this there. Oh, okay. Yeah, we had an absolute nightmare. It was a nightmare. So Oak ordered them and he got, because it's American, he got a US 6, which is a UK 5. Yeah. Meant to be, because they're women's. America do men's and women's different, so. A US 6 was a women's 3.5. So they came and they were three and a half. So we reordered them. And now we've got a four and a half and they literally fit perfect. How sick. How freaking sick. I haven't even tried this one on yet. But I tried this one on yesterday. Oh my god, they were new favourite trainers. And another pair of shoes that I got were these. I needed some sliders for holiday because I don't own any sliders for some reason. So I got these ones. They're like the Yeezy dupes. They're from Ego. I got my an ASOS, so if they are in stock, I will link them below if you want to go get some. But they were literally like £12, and I think they're sick. But they come up quite small, so if you're going to get them, size off. Because these are a 6, and I'm a size 5. And there's like not that much room in there. But they're still cute though. What like, side of the bed do you want? Left side. This side. I'll give you a quick room tour before it gets messy. <sighs> it's just like your standard kind of hotel room, anyway. Mm -hmm. So you come in through this door, we'll do the bathroom first. And she's got a nice big bathroom. Nice mirror. Oh, oh the mirror's got lights in. I see. Yeah? How'd you turn it on? Hi there, should we work? Oh. Um, I don't think they work. Oh, there we go. Ooh, well, I'm gonna be getting ready here later. Got a bath, a shower, and then this is what the room looks like. We've got a wild oak stuff. And we've got like a desk area, which we're probably not going to use. I bet the bed is yidge. Mm, the bed is yidge. yidge. And then a little telly on the wall. And a few wardrobes. Probably That's not so going to... Oh, nearly fell over. Probably not going to use these because we're literally just here for the night. And then a little seating area. Mm. It's cute. It'll do. It'll, that'll do, don't care. But now we're going to get our beach stuff out. And we're going to go and chill around the pool while it's still sunny outside. I'm not going to bring my camera down to the pool because it's literally pointless, but yeah. We'll see you later when... We've got more plans to go out later, so the vlog will start getting a bit more exciting from later. Been a lot more presentable than we did earlier. It's freaking... Oh, it's literally so humid in here. My hair is sticking to the back of my neck. So we're after playing mini golf now. It's called... What's it called? Mr Mulligan. Mr Mulligan. Mr yeah. Mulligan's. Me, Oak, his mum and dad are going, so... I'm definitely going to win. Just going to put that out there now. I'm gonna win because I'm a pro at goal. But yeah, I think we're gonna go for some drinks first. So I'll bring you along with me. Do you wanna yep. see my outfit, guys? Can you show my outfit, Oakster? Look at this sexy bitch. Look at my outfit. So I got this from Zara earlier. It's literally 6 dollars I think. Shorts are from Shein. They're absolutely massive, but it's fine. And then my new shoes, which I'm oi, in. Oi. Yeah. And then my bag is also Zara. You look sick. Thank you. So I'm already. Hey. Let's get to golf. Let's do it. Let's fucking do it. Good choice, the hot Who's next, man? Thank you. 
This is tragic. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. So next day we didn't vlog anything last night because we just went for food and then went home so it wasn't really anything exciting but today i was inside the gray, gray skies are gone but they're not really yeah but, better than but we've got some blue skies sun's out as well sun's out guns out extra <laughs> look at this our hotel is literally that one over there and then this is what we see so pretty we've got like a date day planned we're going to be sitting on the beach we're going to have some chips on the beach we're going to go to the arcades some chips and then I saw an off-white top that I really want, I think. You're getting it, alright. So I think I'm going to get it. You so are. we're going to go back to that shop and no get barley. that. No barley, no barley. And I bought a couple of outfits in this bag. We're going to get a few pictures while we're here as well. I'll make the most of the pretty Bournemouth seaside, rather than Birmingham all the time. Yeah, walk down a mad steep hill. I know, the hill to go down isn't bad, but the hill to go up. I think we're going to walk around the long way, go to town, and walk the long way rather than walk up the hill. <laughs> I'm doing socks and sliders today. <laughs> Oak just doing sliders. Stop it. Oak, just stop it. It looks so beautiful from down here. Compared to yesterday, it wasn't like amazing yesterday, it was Oak? Because it wasn't that sunny, but today. Today it's banging, you know. And as well, we were a bit sad in bed yesterday because it was so in. It's going to be cloudy all day, won't it? Yeah, it's supposed to be cloudy, but look at this. Mother Nature pulled through. I just love being by the seaside. How'd you add to this Lol. This sandwich you use on Instagram. There you go. Hey. Hey. Oak's doing it to go away. <laughs> Look at what. Chilling. <laughs> Chilling. I want to go put my toes in, but Oak's not going to join me. Ah, you know what it is? I've Come got on. some mad nah. phobia of each. No, you haven't. No, phobia of having sand in feet. Yeah, he doesn't like getting sand in between his toes, but that's what it's all about. Nah, normal sand's boring with the wet sand. Come on. Come on, hands. <laughs> Let's go. That's cute, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, well, the sand is so sick. It's crazy. Oh, I'm not ready for it. Let's go. My ankle's freezing. Oh, but it's freezing. Oh, oh. So nice, sir. Yeah. Oh my god, it's so cold. Is that it? Are you doing it? Make a video of you running across the beach. Yeah, go on, bang one. Come on. Come on in. Save me. Save me. <laughs> Just out here living my best life. I've got sausage and chips. But I'm from that van literally right behind me. We're sitting on the beach. Just like a dream come true. Chips on the beach. Just a bit sad they're not actual chippy chips. But still. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, so much vinegar, man. Uh, I'm well. Yeah. You have to do it yourself, so I'm not complaining. Sure. You can put the whole bottle on. I'm well. Been holding back, did you? No. Maybe that was just one that had loads of vinegar on. Try that one. Mm -hmm. Fine, more for me. But it's time. It's time. We're going to get the top that I want, so I'll show you when we're in there. We've never heard of the shop that actually sells this stuff. It's called Browns. But never heard of it. Don't know about you. It's got Jordans in the window. It's attractive, man. Yeah, so it's Browns of Bournemouth. This is what it looks like. Let's go. More trainers. Come on, Shan. Show us. How cute. Isn't she cute? Bad. Get so it. Sick. Get it. I think I'm gonna try it on over this first. Get it. First, get, it. And then. get it. Get it. <laughs> I've only got one size, but it's a medium, I think. Yeah. So I'm gonna try it. Get it. And I might get it because imagine that in the summer. What are you gonna do? Get it. Get it. Let me get it. You look fit. What are we saying? Get it. Still get it. Yeah, we'll see. Do it. That's so sick. I'm getting it. Found a sick spot for Oak. 
He was literally looking at these a few weeks ago and just found them in the shop. Bad boys. Bad boys gonna try mine. Update, they were too tight. <laughs> but with my top though, it's so cute. Summer vibes or what? Oaks got his first milkshake off the little tree. Have you tasted it yet? Yes. Sick enough. Is it? Yeah. He got two scoops of chocolate little, and one um, scoop of salted caramel. Got little chewy bits of like caramel in it. Is it? Yeah. A holiday for me is never complete without like 17 milkshakes. Yeah, when we went to Dubai, he literally had about four milkshakes a day. That's nah, not even being dramatic. <laughs> it's actually more. We're trying to find a Costa because I want a mango and passion fruit cooler, but the one we just walked past is closed down. Yeah, look, look, look. This place can have some like that. No. 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 Oh. What Costa? Guys, we found some scooters. Hope <laughs> getting it sorted, but. We're going on some barrel scooters. We're going to take a ride along the beach. It's better. And now we're going to the pier. We're going to go into the arcades and play some games. We just went to an arcade that's like down there. And it's literally the worst arcade I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> you go in and it just stops straight away. Yeah. Normally arcades are a lot big and you go in there's more and more. But there's literally nothing in there. And then the two P machines you could win rubbers. And that's it. In every single machine it was the same. Come on then. I'll give you a tenner to dive off there. <laughs> right, let's go play some games. I've only got two bars battery but I'll film what I can. What are you doing, Sham? Failing at colouring. Oak picked the colour in for me. <laughs> doing stitch, but I've gone around the outline of him in blue, so I've actually colour in stitch in blue. Stupid. Easy mistake. Easy mistake, isn't it? Come on, let me see. Come on. Right, let me really see your colour. Artistry. Oh. Did you go out Oh, you know what? Fuck it, that's his mouth anyway. It's got to be blue. <laughs> Guys, we're at this. Is it a bar? What do you call it a bar? Yeah. Bar and grill. On the pier, we had to pay Mate, one. The prices. That's what I was going to say. Get ready for this. We had to pay £1.30 just to get into here. There's no two p machine. Oh yeah, we, there's no arcades. We got into the pier. It's all rock climbing. We don't want to do rock climbing, to be honest. So no arcades for us. Ready, guys. Can of coke. Dun, dun, dun. One pound fifty. No. Three pound twenty for a can of coke. But we've just paid four pound for a glass of orange juice each. Great. Oh well. It's worth it. We're on holiday. Not real money anyway. Monopoly money. I wish we stayed another night, but at the same time. I feel like we've done everything that we're supposed to do. Yeah, there's, there's not, not really much, much to actually do. Yeah, my favourite part so far has been our barrels. <laughs> our barrel scooters. If you barrel get a chance scooters. to go on a barrel scooter, do it, guys. They're so not called barrel, though, in uh... Birmingham. Yeah. If you see any electric scooter anywhere, go on them. They're so fun. They actually Sick. go really fast as well. They don't think it's going to be fast. It's really fast. Specifically 12.5 miles per hour. Oh, but definitely worth £4. Mm. Quite nice. Fuck. <laughs> It does look like a good glass of orange juice though, look at that. Mm. Mm. It's good orange juice though, I'll give it that. Guys, we found some better arcades. Is that inconsiderate? Literally, literally right in front of our faces. Like, there's loads of games in here for us to play. Got more power coins already. This is amazing. Found some two peas. Let's do it. Oh. 
start it's on a red bar but I wanted to show you our food before we go home this is like the last stop of the day and then we're going home oh it's gone to get sauces we tried to go into Nando's but the queue was like a two hour wait and I don't want to wait that long so I'll show you what we've got we've got into Hard Guys and 